Hello students. Now we'll discuss the question number three of exercise 2.2. But before discussing the parts of question number three, I'm telling you how to take something common, which will make our calculation easy. So, for an example, if there is a question, four into six plus eight into ten. That two ways of solving. First, you will multiply six into four. That is twenty-four. Second, you will multiply eight into ten. But if the digits are big or large, then we have to take common so that our calculation becomes easy. For example, all these numbers come in the table of two. So two can be taken out common, and inside the bracket we can write two because two twos are four into three because two threes are six. Plus four because two fours are eight and five because two fives are ten. So now the calculation becomes easy because it's like three two is a six plus five fours are twenty, which will give you. And now you can multiply this inside. Means twelve plus forty that will give you fifty two. That is the required answer. So this is the first way of taking common. That means this is the first example. In the second example, you can take this to be too simpler. Like if it is like eight into two plus eight into eight. In this question, we can take eight common outside. If we take eight common outside, then inside the bracket there remains two because eight to the sixteen here it is sixteen plus eight. Eight eight is a sixty-four. Eight eight is a sixty-four. Now it becomes easy because eight plus two is ten, and outside the bracket there is eight. So eight into ten it will give us eighty. This method saves a lot of time. For example, in these type of questions, you cannot multiply two ninety-seven into seventeen plus two ninety-seven into three. First, to solve this question, we will take two ninety-seven as common. Inside the bracket there remains seventeen. Plus two ninety seven is also common from this side, so inside there remains three. We all know seventy plus three is twenty, so that will be two ninety seven into twenty. We can multiply this and get our required answer. That is five nine four zero, and this is the required answer. In the second question, again, we can think that five two five four two seven nine is on the left hand side also and on the right hand side also. So this can be taken out as common five four two seven nine. In the bracket there remains ninety two plus eight. Ninety two plus eight we almost hundred. So the answer will be five four two seven nine into hundred. That is five four two seven nine double zero, and this is the answer. In the third part, it is eight one two six five on this side also and this side also. So we can take out this to be common eight one two six five. In the bracket there remains one sixty nine minus sixty nine. This will give us hundred. So it will be. Eight one two six five multiplied by hundred. That is eight one two six five double zero. Now in this question, if we think of taking out common like this, this is not possible. This is a similar example like this. So we have to take out the factors that to be common. So I'll solve it here. First of all, the factor that can be taken out as common is five because five. And twenty-five is also multiple of five. So first, we take five to be common. This is inside remains three eight four five multiplied by seven hundred and eighty-two plus seven hundred and sixty-nine. Five five is a twenty-five. So multiply by five and multiply by two hundred and. Eighteen. Now two can be taken out as common, like five 
multiply by 2. So this will give us 3, 8, 4, 5 multiply by 2, 3 is a 6, 2, 9 is a 18, 2, 1 is a 2 plus 769 as it is multiply by 5, multiply by 1, 0, 9. Now we can again take 5 as common. You can see this is a multiple of 5 because at the end it is 5. So it will be 5 to the 10 and 5 we are again taking common so it will be 10 into 5. 5 7 is a 35. Remainder 3. 5 6 is a 30 and 5 9 is a 45. Now you can see that this is also present on the left hand side. So first we will copy it as it is into 391 plus 769 into 109. So 769 can be taken out as common. So it will be 10 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 769. Inside there remains 391 plus 109. 9 can be added to this, it will make it 400 and 100 more, that is 500. So it will be 10 into 5 into 769 into 500. So here it will be 2500 into 10, that is 25,000 into 769. So, we will multiply 769 by 25 that you all can multiply and we get a required answer and that answer will be into 10 to power 3 and 769 multiplied by 25. That we have to do because we cannot do or if you want then we can write 25 as 20 plus 5 and outside there is 769. So first of all 769 can be multiplied by 20 then 769 can be multiplied by 5 and after all the together result we can multiply it with by 10 to the power 3. So 9 to the 18 carry 1, 6 to the 12 and 13 carry 1 and 15, 15380 plus 769 into 5, 9 5 is a 45 carry 4. 34 carry 3 and 38. So it will be 15380 plus 3845 multiplied by 10 to the power 3. So our required answer will be 5, 8 and 4, 12 carry 1, 9 and 3, 12 carry 1, 9, 1 into 10 to the power 3. This is the required answer. I hope you understood this question and this is the required answer. Thank you.